dough, I make them bitches hit the flow for keys. Ryan Crown Vic on 23s just because of these Triple Sip Mafia. About to buy this week. YouTube, what's good? It's your boy Wavy. I know this is my channel, Mr. Orchard Beach. You new to the channel, you haven't hit that subscribe button yet? Hit that subscribe button, like, comment. All the above. All right, before we get into this vid, since I'm on the couch, you already know, wavy magic. Turn off the base, check out. Oh, all right, bam. Got that flying dog joint. This Imperial IPA called The Truth. Ooh, and it is The Truth. 8.7, you already know, word. I actually stole this opener from P. We gonna keep that on the low. Yeah, it's a good joint right here, I ain't gonna lie. No wavy magic for this one. I wanna um put y'all on to a little drinky drink. Y'all probably already know about it though, but anyway. All right, what we got here is the uh, Crown Royal Texas Mesquite Edition. You already know, it's, it's all about that Texas, you know what I'm saying, H-Town. And it is the truth that botany is the block that stays crunk at all time. You can't stop this, baby. Clover land. But anyway, yo, um, yeah, no, um, this joint right here, I can taste like the wood chips in it. Pause. Um, you know, but yeah, it's straight. So this is how you drink this. This is um, a little recipe that they came, came with. They was like, yo, they said get you a cup with crushed ice, but you know what I'm saying? We'll make sure I think I got crushed ice up in here, you know? Or, so anyway, I'm gonna pour you a little bit. Always two second pour, you know what I'm saying? You can get you some ginger beer. Now, for y'all that's never had no ginger beer before, it is kind of crucial. If you ever had like some real ginger ale, like that ginger ginger, I ain't talking about Schweppes or none of that, this is on that level, watch this. All right, I, I wanted to cough and do all that, but anyway, F all that. But yeah, it's kind of there. All right, so a little bit of, just a little bit. All right, cool. Finally, get you some lemon. Squeeze that joint up in there. Mix it around a little bit, you know? It's good. Now, nah, <laughs> nah, it's tough. Before we get into this vid, um, can we get this video to 250 likes? Let me get 250 likes on this joint. Matter of fact, forget that. Let me get 300 likes. Wave Mob is definitely in the building. Oh, um, on feet today, just won the show. 2006, ow. <laughs> but um, anyway, man, F all that. We about to get into the vid. Let me get a little, all right. All right, boom. So the reason for this vid, you already know, I got a few pickups. Okay, here they go. Um, We're gonna start with the Nike joint first. Ugh. Boom. I actually went to, uh, shout out to Jersey, I went to Bergen Outlets because I didn't want to go all the way up to, what is it, uh, Connecticut and get disappointed. So I did go to the outlets out in Jersey. First time there, it was crazy. Once I first got to the, the Nike store, which I didn't see was, I ran into a homie that uh, that I met through one of my homies down at CIAA. I was like, oh, all right, boom. You know what I'm saying? Nah, that's my man. Shout out to uh, Ron. And then I actually, uh, when I was in, Adidas, window shopping. I uh, ran into Freak, bro. They go that Earl, nigga. <laughs> Earl has struck again. Let's get into this joint. Nike, bam. Um, I'm, uh, I'm just gonna, I'm trying to save the best for last. All right, the first, bam, got me some joggers right here. Boom. These joints, they don't have the zip like the, like the other fleece joints used to have to. Used to have them, my bad. They don't have them joints, but yeah, I do. The pockets are pretty cool. I wouldn't put that much in the pockets because I actually, I actually went with the, oh, I want, damn, I messed up. I copped the medium on another joint because that was the only size they had. Damn it. All right, whatever. If I do end up going back, I'll swap these joints out. But uh, yeah, so yeah, these, here they go right there. They're pretty smooth though. Got your white Nike. Letter in with the swoosh on the left leg, followed by the white stripe going down the joint. Oh, and what did I pay for them? Let me see. They were, they originally, the price was, suggested retail was $65. Then they had it at $44.99 and I got it for $24.29. That was with their discount and my military discount. Saved the extra 10% off of what they had. Damn, I'll try them on though. All right, next up, boom. See, I've been doing the medium thing. That's why I'm like, damn, I might have to, yeah, I might have to swap them joints out. So I got these in the medium. They're like some olive color, just some slim fit joints. I did try on the large. It was, it was like a little bit more baggy to them. So I went ahead and just got the medium. Not really much pocket with these joints right here. So I wouldn't really put my wallet in the front pocket, maybe in the back, but I wish that it would have had like a, 
a button or something to kind of like conceal it or maybe some Velcro to kind of keep your wallet up in there. So probably the bare minimum to when you're trying to carry extra things with these. Word. But no, nah, these are cool right here, man. Olive color joints, bam. Black Nike swoosh at the bottom. Got your, what is this? I don't know, elastic hit right there, yeah. Um, the price was suggested retail, it was 55 bucks. Then it dropped down to $39.99, and then I got them for, still can't believe, man. I, I'm gonna try them on, man. I hope it's a success. But I think they was a little baggy, but let me get off that. Uh, I got them for $21.59, so $21.59 for these joints. Damn, how we get so? Next joints, we staying on pants. Mother, okay, bam. See, I got a medium in these. These joints is fly. Uh, yeah, I went ahead and got the medium in these because I, I know exactly what I'm gonna rock with these. It's either gonna be my fake frags or I can finally break out my Uptown Harlems, the white and royals finally. I ain't broke them out in a bit. Same joints like the other one, Nike. Got your white stripe right here, white stripe right here. And if you do wanna put the wallet in the back, you got, you got the zipper right here. That's what I would have wished that they had in these ones right here, but. They did not, but yeah, nah, these, these shorts is hard. Like I said, I did try them on. The large was a little baggy, and maybe I need to cut down on the beer to throw these on, but whatever, man. Yo, these joints is, these joints is pretty fly. I paid the same price as the other, what was it, like 24.29. That's how much I paid for these joints. So that's another, let's say 25 for the joggers. You can't go wrong off that, yo, 25, where? Next up, I got a hoodie. I paid like 24 for it. Uh, su suggested retail right off the gate was, and I know I'm showing the price already, 85, then they had 44, and I paid, I paid 20, 25 bucks. Bam, got the, the green hoodie, black Nike swoosh right there, something simple, just throw on. I tried the medium on this joint, and uh, I remember because those are, those are, well, there was actually two females at the fitting room, and I was like, hey, uh, am I forcing it with the- Yes. Before I could even say it, it was, and, uh, yo, salute, I appreciate that, you know what I'm saying? So I went to the large, a little chilling kill. Uh, had to go back blue, <laughs> or bam, got this joint. Yeah, so I already, I already think I, I, I might be just blued out, yeah. Cause this is that, you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking this is that. It ain't that part of it. Just get something underneath to break up the monotony and we're good. But anyway, so this is the other hoodie right here. White Nike swoosh. Little pockets in the inside right here. I do like how it hits and it feels pretty good. It does feel pretty good. Um, nice joint for, for right now, especially fall time. It's gonna keep you warm. Uh, I was almost showing y'all a sneak peek of the last one. But uh, yeah, so that's the joint right there. This last one, this is my joint right here. And I ain't really catch no savings on it, but Yo, I got something, at least 10%. Man, that ain't shit. They saw your ghetto ass coming from miles away, nigga. Yo, check this joint. Bam. It's like a windbreaker, but it's got like an extra layer in the inside. You see? And it'll keep you warm. Now, this ain't no joint when it's mad cold like you can rock, but yeah. Now, I like this joint. The reason why I like it is it reminds me of a windbreaker that I had back in the day. That was pretty hard. Same type of colorway. I believe I could rock this with my fake frags. You know what I'm saying? I was thinking fake frags like the whole time. So, uh, right here, you got your pouch that you can put some of your belongings in. It also has that liner right there. They don't have any pockets in the uh, on the side. Really, you don't really need them. But I do remember that. Another thing that it reminds me of, the, those old Cybertechs. You remember them Cybertechs? Yeah. Now, back in NC, the Cybertech used to hold me down in the cold. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, nah, this joint hard. Got the hoodie. Got your royal blue drawstrings. Black Nike box. Nike Air lettering and the swoosh in white. Let me know what y'all think about this joint right here. Uh, I paid. I thought it was a 40%. I'm gonna I'm call back, and now that I know that I accidentally got that, that joint in the medium, if I try them, I'm gonna call back and see. But suggested retail on this joint was uh, 110, then it dropped down to 79.99, and I thought it was 40% off. I might have just grabbed it from the wrong place, but I did get my 10%, so it was like 71 something. So I paid 71 for it, and I ain't really tripping because. I, I do like this. Like this, this, this joint fly. Like this is the first thing I saw when I was in there. I was like, oh yo, it's on. Now they didn't really have any sneaks over there, so I, was, you know, I just went through the whole motion. If you haven't seen the vid, check out that vid. Next up, I had to go to um, 
what is it, uh, Century 21. And I had, uh, what I go, oh yeah, cause even though like Nike wear, like it's gear, but it, to me it's like chill and kill. Like you ain't really gonna step in the club off the Nike tech like that. You know what I mean? Like it's uh, lounge, okay, but you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's okay. But anyway, we'll, we'll get into that some other time. So yo, I went to the outlet Century 21, two pickups. My first pickup was, uh, I got this joint right here, this flannel from Super Dry. You can tell, like I said, man, everything was fake frags with D, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so yeah, I got this joint for Super Dry. Uh, the plaid joint, it was a no brainer. What size did I get? It was a, uh, I got the, it was an extra large because I guess they kind of fit, you know, they kind of hug on you because I'm usually a large. Yeah, the joint hard right here. It also allows you if you want to roll up your sleeves, you can do that and you can catch that. Let me see. Well, I don't know why this button is right here. I don't know, tell the truth. I don't know, it's gotta be something. Maybe you, I guess you can catch it when you roll up your sleeves. But anyway, man, forget that. This joint's pretty tough though, I ain't gonna lie. A little chill and kill, boom, boom. Yeah, I like, I like plaids for, for fall, for real. Lumberjack fit. Uh, how much did I pay for this joint? Bam, it was $49, I paid $27 for it. So yeah, that's straight. It would definitely get rocked this upcoming weekend, hopefully. Or, and last but not least, you know I talk about the gear and talk about all that. I see uh, uh, other YouTubers, they're talking about the gear too. But you know, you gotta have the essentials as well. <laughs> so anyway, uh, boom, I got the, damn, can we see it? Uh, I got the Jimmy Choo, Man Ice. Pause. I think it was like 99, but then they had it for like six. What am I thinking for? <laughs> I ain't gotta think, oh yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it was 69. The joint was originally 99.99, then they had it for 69. Shout out to um, boy that told me about the joint because I was going around different colognes. Tell the truth, backstory, I didn't start rocking cologne until like, uh, I was probably like 21, 22. Word, <laughs> like I didn't see the point. It was like, I, right, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I did start getting the colognes at that age. I usually keep about three to four different colognes. I am thinking about trying to uh, mess with Scentbird. If I do, I'll let y'all know about that journey. I wanted a new smell, didn't know what I wanted to get. I don't like spice, so all that was out of the question. I've been rocking Chanel, YSL. I got the, what is it, uh, Mont Blanc, and a few others. I think I got Rockaware too. Yeah, like I said, shout out to the uh, homie that told me to get the the gift, the whole, the gift set, instead of just getting the one, cause I think the one was like 59 and I just pay extra 10 bucks and I get like a whole nother joint. So shout out to you on that. Anyway, gotta get y'all up out of here, y'all. Yo, come on, man. Drink champs, make some noise. Yeah, let me know what y'all think about the pickups. Uh, Back to the Nike right quick. All the, uh, everything that I grabbed from Nike, my savings was like $109. I'm gonna tell you how much I spent. Uh, I spent $190.74. I don't believe there ain't no tax in Jersey. Yo, shout out to Jersey. I spent like $190.74. I saved like 110 bucks. Yeah, like I said, if you haven't seen that uh, vlog, check that joint out. I think I'm gonna start hitting them up more. I'm about to go right now because I wanna try on those other pants. Um, another quick tip that I wanna throw out there, whenever you don't have anybody with you and you're going to dress like you're dressing yourself this is something i always have to do i'm not too really i'm not really too keen on asking a guy i would have to know that this dude is like a, somebody that's quick to crack to crack jokes so i know that he'll he'll be straight up with you and he'll joke like nah that ain't what you all right cool you know what I'm saying with that but no i like to get a female's point of view it's like yo uh is this am i forcing it am i doing that that's what i always do when i go to a dressing room i didn't feel like um tagging my or uh, sending a picture to my cousin and waiting so i was just like yo ma yo what you think like you know cool i'm gonna take your advice for it but anyway yeah so that's what i usually do just like with the but i didn't get to do it yesterday with the cologne i like to deal with a woman what do you like you know only reason why i didn't 
ask Shorty was because she had asked me about my sneaks. She was like, yo, I wanted those. So I, I knew you, yo, you into sneaks and she like that. So we just gonna keep it on the what up homie type 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 vibe. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, man, can we get this bit to like 300 likes? Hell no, god damn it. I appreciate it if we can. Shout out to the Wave Mind, shout out to everybody that's been rocking with me. Hope y'all enjoying y'all weekend. Oh, by the time y'all see this, the week's already um going. Uh this is actually my birthday week, so you know what I'm saying? I'm showering myself with nothing. But <laughs> anyway, man, uh F all that. I'm about to get up out. Out of here, y'all already know. Follow me on that snap, follow me on that IG, follow me on that Twitter. That Twitter be Yo! Put that snubs. Everything's okay. It's your boy Wavy. This is my channel, Mr. Orchard Beach. Sneaker rotation number 125 is gonna be a bridge. Make sure you report to it. See when I see you out.